this is Riker Milligan here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to summon the Wall of Flesh. Now, the Wall of Flesh is the monster in hell, and you need to mine very far down. He honestly is a... For beginners, he's pretty hard. He is not that easy. And... Once you defeat the Wall of Flesh, you will be able to summon wyverns, you'll be able to get the wings, you'll be able to get souls. There's many things that you'll be able to do when you defeat the Wall of Flesh. The Wall of Flesh is not that hard. It, it really matters about the armor you have. If you don't have good armor, it's going to be hard. And a mini shark, a mini shark, and I say, what, a mini shark... And just a good sword is, yeah. Once you get hardcore mode, also you'll be able to get these crystals, and you'll be able to use crystal storms, and you'll be able to make mythical rainbow rods, and all sorts of stuff. And there's going to be Nimbus rods that you can get. There's going to be more bosses because you can Skeletron Prime is one of the bosses. Now there's a way you can summon him. He's honestly not that hard. You just need to look around. First thing to summoning him, I already have a guide voodoo doll. But you need to find a demon. They f not the that's not a demon. It's like a flying little hell thing. And there's one going to be one called a voodoo demon. Now the voodoo demon, if you kill it, it no matter what, it is a 100% chance that it will drop a voodoo doll. What you do with the voodoo, voodoo doll, you go up to it in your inventory, you press R1, and you'll drop it. But well, you have to drop it in the lava, and it'll summon the wall of flesh. So, give me a sec. See? I dropped it in there, the wall of flesh has been awoken. The wall of flesh is easy, in my opinion, because how far I am. But, yeah. Really good armor is recommended, and also if you could, once you defeat Skeletron, the knives that you get from down there, stuff like that. But a mini shark is also recommended, and silver bullets. Silver bullets are really nice. He's not that hard, and. He, once you defeat him, he drops items, he drops the wild, he drops emblems, yes, so he drops that, and he also drops a punch hammer, no matter what, he will drop this. Now with this, it's really good to use that, because then you can use that to, you can use that to, uh, kill demon altars and demon altars are very very awesome they you can kill all of them in the world I've already done that and so I had to make another one in order to get uh, the other demon altars but uh so when you kill a demon altar your world gets blessed with new ores things like mithril and crystals and it gets blessed with all sorts of cool stuff it gets blessed with like really good ores, and Chlorophyte is the best mind ore you can get. Cool, thanks for watching, like, subscribe, comment, and until the next video.